Hello everyone and welcome to my Sister Wives Today channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Janelle from Sister Wives claims her new apartment has served as a sanctuary apart from Cody. It went better than Cody Brown's expectations when she visited her ex-wife Janelle Brown's new pad on Sunday's Sister Wives episode. On Sunday's Sister Wives episode, Janelle Brown welcomed a visitor to her new residence. In the episode, Janelle's 54-year-old ex-husband Cody Brown paid her and her 18-year-old daughter Savannah a visit. This was Cody's first visit to the house, which Janelle, 54, told the cameras has served as a little sanctuary for her since her breakup. Well, since he has never been here, I suppose this has been a pleasant place for him. Thus, it seems to be somewhat of my area, she remarked. I sort of liked having it as my little sanctuary. After years of polygamy after Janelle, Mary, and Christine left him, Cody is currently in a monogamous marriage with Robin. He disclosed in a separate confessional that it was just dawning on him that maybe the whole reason Janelle moved here was because the other apartment was our place. He first stated, you know I was living there with her, and she's moved here and doesn't look like I'll be living here with her, then clarified, it's her apartment. We do not own it. However, there isn't place for me. It is not between her and me. Since our kid lives there, I'm not sure why she's showing me, to be honest. Janelle subsequently stated that Cody's visit went better than she had anticipated for the trio's meeting at the new location. Even though Cody's presence consisted mostly of small conversation, Janelle saw it as a victory. The meeting comes after a blowout brawl between the two in a September episode of Sister Wives aired. This is the first time he's been in my house since we had our fight, so I think there's still echoes of that in my mind, Janelle continued. However, there were none. Crossword puzzles were absent. We all got along well. It went smoothly. It went more smoothly than I could have imagined. In a similar manner, Cody asked Janelle why she moved residences on Sunday's show, saying he had forgotten because off the top of my head, I don't remember why she moved. After telling the cameras why he and his sons, Garrison and Gabe, are estranged, Cody changed the topic of conversation from Janelle's present apartment to what she is preparing for the family's Coyote Pass property while he was visiting his daughter. He isn't financing the house I am building with any money. I find this wee idea confusing, Janelle said to the cameras. I handle the financing myself. It reminds me of a time when we actually thought of all the family belonging to the entire family. However, that is no longer really relevant. Since everything about this situation has been awkward, we've kind of ran out of topics to talk about that aren't too shallow right now. We're all kind of like, ah, now, she continued. Cody said that he's not even welcome at Janelle's place in another scene of the show, which is why he thought the visit was so awkward. After taking a look around this flat, it's pretty clear to me that I will never be able to live there. For example, why am I mentioning a deep sink? I'll never do dishes in there, so who cares, he remarked. He later clarified the small chat by saying, I have a whole life outside of Savannah and Janelle, but whenever I'm with them, I don't talk about any of my other life. And because that consumes most of my time and most of my life, I don't have anything to talk about. Cody and Janelle's daughter seemed to be getting along better after their argument, as Janelle revealed on Sunday's show that he was seeing her more frequently. My bond with Savannah is tender and kind. As previously reported, he said, I haven't been in contact with Gabriel and Garrison for quite a while. The fact that I'm no longer close to them makes me sad. We just had so many amazing experiences together and did so many beautiful things in our life, Cody continued. I believe and hope that we will eventually move past this and feel comfortable around one another again. There's not exactly an open door between Gabe and Garrison at the moment. They are unwilling to interact with me. Sister Wives, eight indices that Cody manipulated his connection with although Mary was surprised to learn that Mary had been lying about their connection, few other series watchers were taken aback. Despite being the longest married couple in the Brown family, Cody and Mary have struggled in their marriage for many years. Things may be about to change in Mary and Cody's turbulent relationship now that she has finally opened her eyes to the problems they have been having. However, during their time together, Cody and Mary have been on completely different wavelengths, and Sister Wives season 18 viewers are aware that he has been lying about their connection for a long time. Although Cody and Mary have been married for more than 30 years, 
There have been many problems in their marriage throughout the past 10 years. Miri's high-profile catfishing controversy and Robin Brown's decision to divorce her have both negatively impacted their marriage and caused them to grow suspicious of one another. Over time, Cody's feelings for Mary have diminished, and despite her attempts to hold on to her spouse, Miri has become a more self-reliant person in recent years. Miri has been creating a life for herself, while Cody has been attempting to establish his life with Robin. Cody has frequently been spotted making fun of Mary on Sister Wives, despite his claims that he always attempts to be a positive influence on his family's lives. Cody and Mary's marriage was portrayed on the show as a lovely, stable union for many years. The basis of Cody and Mary's marriage started to crumble after years of marriage, and as he grew more infatuated with Robin, he lost interest in his other wives, particularly Mary. On Sister Wives, Cody has talked a lot about how he doesn't like Mary's appearance, thinks her to be emotionally and physically repulsive, and has lost interest in her as a person. It was discovered in 2015 that Mary had been having an illicit affair with a man she believed to be named Sam. Before exchanging phone numbers and starting to text, Mary and Sam had communicated over Twitter. Mary shared intimate words and pictures with Sam when the messages quickly got improper, only to discover later that she had been tricked by someone using false identity. In reality, Sam was a woman by the name of Jackie, who made Mary known to the public by broadcasting her texts and revealing their relationship to everyone. Clearly saddened, Cody never really forgiven Mary for coming out to him, even though it was with a fictitious person. Over the years, it became evident that Cody was providing Robin with the greatest care of all his wives, but he was also providing more attention to Christine Brown and Janelle Brown than he did to Mary. Even if Janelle and Christine had bigger families than Mary's, it wasn't right that he wasn't allocating the same amount of attention to each of his four wives. Even though Cody was supposed to treat his wives equally, he continued to put Mary at the bottom of the priority list in order to spend as little time as possible with her. Cody chose to avoid talking to Mary instead of expressing his feelings. In an attempt to get Cody to express some interest in what Mary intended to accomplish with her life going ahead, she told him about her future ambitions during Sister Wives Season 18 Episode 9. Despite her intention to transfer her business operations from Arizona to Utah, Mary clarified that she would not be relocating. She was hoped to move to a smaller place and downsize instead. Cody offered Mary the loft above his backyard barn, thinking he was being kind. Mary was told that she was to be treated like Cody's trash and thrown in the shed, instead of being assisted in finding a place of her own. The adult Brown family members all worn cladag rings for years as a sign of their undying love for one another. The Sister Wives cast members bought their rings for one another as tokens of their lifetime devotion to their families and good intentions. The Clada rings were intended to be a unique emblem for each other rather than wedding rings. Cody has started wearing a new ring lately as a sign of his dedication to Robin. Cody purposely said nothing when Mary inquired about the ring.